Hi folks, Carol Ann here from SassyTownhouseLiving.com and today I'm pretty excited to be able to share with you an awesome long tail keyword finder tool and you can find this tool on the internet at kwfinder.com. I will have all the links and the information in this video description as well as in my blog post. So let me just dive right in. I want to make this video as quick as I can to be able to show you some of the key points of this tool and why I love it and use it daily. So as I said, it's called Keyword Finder and um, what you do is, is first you need to obviously have some keywords that you want to research and see what your competition is out there, what you're up against, and what are the most highly optimized keywords for you to be using. So if you're a blogger or a business owner, you know exactly how important it is to make sure that you're optimizing your SEO, your keywords, to drive traffic to your website. So as a blogger, um, keywords have become more and more important to me as the years went by, I realized just how valuable they are to me and my business and making sure that I have the right titles with the right keywords is so important and using this tool gets me there. So let me quickly go over with you some of the key areas of why I love this tool. And again, super easy to use, super fast. Now you can either take a deep dive with this tool and spend literally hours searching your keywords and searching your competition or you can just bam you know research your keywords get in and out and do what you need to do quickly so for an example i was searching for fitness goals as um, some of my keywords and this is the interface that you will be faced with when you log in and just a quick mention they do have pricing pricing plans so definitely check them out um, they also have free I think it's five free searches a day so if you just want to use this tool for free you can or for your um, you know highly highly optimized SEO tools you can get into the pricing and start paying for um, like I have um, I get 100 keyword lookups a day with the plan that I'm on and then they also give you your SERP lookups and your backlink rows and so on and so forth so all you need to do is is you know decide which plan works for you and then go with it so as I said this is the interface that you'll be using and I want to mention one of the most important features I think on this tool are the color coding um, and, and if you highlight each of these categories, it very clearly explains to you what they are and what they're for. So this diff category is for SEO difficulty, and it's based on SEO stats. So the number of um, pages on the first Google SERP. So zero, uh, min equals zero, max equals 100. So you can sort very easily by clicking on it and it gives you all of your results in color coding. Now, obviously, we're looking for the best, and the best would be your green. I think anywhere from 25 to 20 and under would be the best keywords to optimize. So once you start getting down here, these are the type of keywords that you're looking for. Um, and if I, if I click on it, like, um, let's pick one here, Fit Girl, okay? So I picked Fit Girl, and you can see that the right side of the pane uh, gave me all the information I needed in literally a second. It's telling me that um, it ranks a 22 out of 100, which is easy. That's my SEO difficulty easy. And if you hover over it, it tells you with a nice graph, 0 to 9 is effortless, 10 to 19 go for it. 20 to 29 easy and so on and so forth okay so real quickly i want to just go over what this right side of the page means so if you hover over each one of these categories it lets you know what they mean so this here is the number of facebook shares for the url and where they rank so this particular website ranks number one and it kind of lets you know what you're up against in terms of beating them so um, they had 
estimated number of visits and and this is monthly search volume they had about 13 and change um k in in number of page views so they're letting me know that they're a little bit tough to beat but again this is great to analyze take a look and see what your competition is doing and what you're up against and real quickly you can click on analyze serp and a page pops up and you get some more details uh, like an expanded view of what you were just looking at you can export the results and also um, manage the metrics so when you click on that you can choose from um, a very large amount of categories what's important for you to look at so for instance if all links were something that I needed to be able to see um, I would just click done and then that would add that category to this heading okay so let me just get out of here and go back to the tool so um, like I said before over on um, the left hand pane this category is to me one of the most important that I tend to focus on now you can this is also very good to the trending and the reason why I like it is because it lets you know during during the last 12 months what the search volume trend is so it's got peaks and valleys in these graphs and it lets you know okay so for here workout apps for kids you can see in the summer months you know if you're looking at this gauge in terms of a year um, the summer months this was searched more highly and that's one of the reasons why I love it so like achievement fitness January it was peaked and, and, and that makes sense because after the holidays a lot of people want to get back in shape so you're going to see January be a big you know a top um, search for that particular category and that's one of the reasons why I do like this field as well these other fields give you your average monthly search volume in the last 12 months this is also very important you know you want to get a good feel uh, to know okay how many times was this keyword total fitness searched in the past 12 months and then you have your CPC and your PPC so that's all good information as well and if you look down here you can create a list and you can export now I don't have any lists created at the moment I had them but I deleted them they're very easy to create um, you just click on it and you can like if I had created a list they would be in here um, let's see you can also filter your results this is also great because if you wanted a min or a max on the number of words in your search you can do that you can include extra keywords in here too so if you wanted to add some additional keywords um, maybe um, like daily fitness or exercise or family fitness you know you can you can do that too and you can also set your SEO difficulty in here too and it's a great little uh, filter to play with to really hone in um, to get exactly the look that you're after in terms of your keywords and you have some categories up here search import like I showed you before you've got a historical perspective of all your searches and basically that's it in terms of like important features now I could go on and on because obviously this could get very in-depth in terms of searching for your keywords but I just wanted to show you this tool just how awesome it is and why it's so important for you as a blogger or a business owner to make sure that you're optimizing your SEO and that you're searching for keywords that are going to empower you and your business and if you see any of these search um, icons here just click them and then they will um, generate the information that you need see it then it populates the information so um, and again this is I have it um, sorted according to uh, ranking difficulty in terms of SEO so definitely head on over to um, keyword finder it's uh, one of the best tools that I've ever used and I've tried several and um, a friend of mine also has a tool 
that she installed on her computer on her desktop and she said it's so convoluted and so difficult to use and when she saw this she actually flipped over it she immediately fell in love with it and um, she has a very successful website and it's very important for her to optimize her keywords and SEO too real quick one of the other things that I absolutely love about this before I used to create my titles so say for instance i had a blog post in mind the very first thing that i would do would be to come up with a strong title so i would spend at least an hour or more creating my title and then i started searching for keywords to fit my title and i found that that limited me greatly and that it was so much easier for me to come in here and say, for instance, I know I'm going to be doing a blog post on my fitness goals. So rather than sit and create my title for an hour, I'm just going to take my, my keywords, search first. And the reason for that is because I've ended up changing my keywords so many times by being able to get a good idea as to what's ranking and what I need to hone in on. So uh, maybe I'll change my title to Lifetime Fitness. And I've done that so many times and wasted my time sitting creating a title for nothing when I really needed to refine, tweak, and optimize my keyword. So that's just a little tip uh, in case you do the same thing that I was doing. Don't waste your time on creating a blog post title. Come in get your keywords optimized look at your competition see what they're doing you know click on on one of their websites do some research see why are they ranking number one scroll through see what what exactly are they doing that i need to be doing too in order for them to be ranking the way that they are and this tool can get you there it can definitely help you achieve that i absolutely am flipping in love with this tool if you're a blogger or a business owner, it's a must have. You just can't do without it. And I have not seen a tool this powerful out there since I've been blogging and that's four years. So um, if you have any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. Thanks so much for watching. Definitely check out the tool. Let me know your thoughts on it. I'd love to hear them. And be sure to stop back. I have lots of great video tutorials and so much more on my YouTube channel, so definitely check them out. Thanks so much again, and have yourself a great and safe day.